Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today is going to be a really short video. I am giving you five first aid questions that you can ask on a date, okay? So the first question is, um, are you single? I know that goes without saying and everybody will be like, duh, isn't that the first thing you must ask? Um, it's very, very important. A lot of times, a lot of women assume that once a man is interested in them, they are single and blah, 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 blah. Sis, don't play yourself. Do not ask him, do you have a girlfriend? I have made that mistake in the past and I've asked the guy, do you have a girlfriend? And he was like, uh, no. Come to find out, he had a whole wife, okay? And then you know his excuse? Um, you did not ask me if I had a wife. You asked if I had a girlfriend. I'm like, nigga! So sis, when you are out on the first day, leave there. What's your favorite color? What's your favorite food? What's your favorite song? Leave those questions for the second date, okay? Ask him, are you single? And by single, I mean you have a wife. <laughs> you have a girlfriend. Do you have a baby mama who thinks you are still together? Or do you have a stalker who still thinks you are still... Like, whatever it is, are you single? Okay? Very important. And then, listen to the answer. Second question that you can ask is, um, what are you looking for? Don't play yourself. Do not assume that he wants the same thing that um, you do because what he's sending you sweet text messages he's 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 sending you expensive gifts and blah 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 ask him nigga what are you looking for do you want a girlfriend are you looking for a baby mama are you looking for a, <laughs> a one night stand are you looking uh, for um friends with benefit are you looking for a wife what are you looking for and listen it's very important to clear that up because a lot of times as women we are guilty of instant relationship once you go on a first date you're like okay you stop choosing your wedding dress sis you have to know that you're on the first you are on the same page it's important the third question that you can ask is um what does monogamy mean to you and do you believe in it that's right this is to me one of the most important questions, if you are like me and you're all about monogamy and you don't share your cakes, you need to ask this question, says, because some men have a pretty effed up idea about what monogamy is. This is the time that again I say, listen, listen, pay attention to his definition of monogamy and whether he believes in it. It is very important in making your decision whether to move forward with him or drop him like it's hot. Okay, because there are men out there, are men out here who do not believe in monogamy, who do not, who whose idea about monogamy is just rubbish. Okay, his idea about monogamy could be well dating you and seeing Emma as well, as well as Sandra, as well as no. Number four, first date question that you can ask is um, this is what I call the triple threat. The triple threat <laughs> is how long was your last relationship? How long has it been since you've been single and why did it end? Sis, it is very, very, very important. It is important test <laughs> to know the history of his dating life. Listen, a man's history will tell you a lot about him. Believe me, if he's been single for just, maybe he said, oh, I broke up last week. Sis, you don't want to be the rebound girl. Vamos out because believe me if you know the history if he's always in a relationship for one month his longest relationship has been one month then you know this guy is not a keeper he's not somebody who can hold down a decent relationship so that's not what you're looking for and you have to also ask why did it end and listen you will learn a lot if he cannot take any responsibility for what happened if it's all um oh it's all her fault oh she was this she was that she was too much she was insecure she was just listen he will give you all the tea okay don't assume that you're special and she was bad that's why it's gonna listen if possible find out the patterns how many have you dated and how why did it end if all of them were crazy and insecure sis 
Okay, enough said. You see, the problem with most of us women is that when we go on a date and we ask some of these important questions, we don't listen. Why? Because we are too busy trying to look cute. You're too busy sucking your stomach in. You're too busy trying to eat cute. You're too busy trying to fix your hair to look good. And you're not listening to what the nigga is saying. He's filling you with a load of bull and you're not listening. 2020, my ladies, level the fudge up. Pay attention. You're not going on no date to look cute. Show up with your pen and paper. Take some notes, lady. First day question number five that you can ask is, what would your ex say about you? Again, my ladies, listen. <laughs> Chase, tell them to listen. It's <laughs> tell them to listen. <laughs> it's very, very important. You know, if he tries to rubbish her and say, "Oh yeah, I'm sure she will say I'm I'm this, I'm that," he will say, "I mean, she will say I'm irresponsible, I'm this, I'm that," but it was all her fault. You know, it means the nigga ain't shit. If he can't take responsibility for some things, at least, all the nigger and shit. These type of guys here, they will start by saying, well, you seem like a nice girl. You seem like, yeah, yeah, yeah. You seem like a level-headed girl. But that one, she was an idiot. She was this, insecure. She was blah, blah, blah. And she probably would say that uh, uh, I am uh, I'm a cheat. I'm this, I'm that. But, you know, I'm sis. Don't be flattered, though. It is today that she, you are not rubbish to him. Tomorrow you will be. If I were you, I would run. <laughs> God knows what's best for me. I got somewhere to be. My time is not for free. What do you want from me? Too many eyes on me. Everybody wanna speak. Is it going to be? What do you know about me? I can't not sleep at night. I can't not breathe at times. My dreams are big and bright.